you're, um, if you're getting beat by a retriever, which is kind of one of the themes that a lot of the kids were talking about, if, if you go to the net and you're practicing volleys, standing and volleying your traditional punch volley from on top of the net is not a very good idea because you're volleying back hard and deep down the middle, giving them more chances to pass you, right? You're basically saying here, oh, you didn't pass me? Well, here, try again. You give another one. So, but I want you to practice swing volleys and drop volleys, not just punch volleys. So I recommend not even doing punch volleys from up here all the time. That might be great when you're a beginner, but a big key is your transition from the baseline. How good are you at recognizing they're vulnerable and moving forward? So this is the next drill that we're gonna, the coaches, we're gonna challenge you with this drill. You're gonna start at the baseline, but you're gonna hit a secondary swing volley first. So the coach is gonna throw up a high heavy ball. So you gotta come in, do a swing volley, then you gotta move forward and really deck a hard transition volley, right? Then you gotta go even closer and do a drop volley. Do you think drop volleys would be important against pusher retrievers? Yeah, they like, they're comfortable back there, right? And remember we talked a little bit earlier um, yesterday about different brain types. Well, pusher retrievers have a certain brain type, right? They don't like things that happen fast. They're sensates, they're often they're more introvert, um, more thinkers. They like to be back behind the court where there's a lot of time to figure things out. Well, if you do drop volleys or drop shots, you're pulling them up where they're not very comfortable, right? They don't want to be up there. So drop volleys are really big. Swing volleys are really big. So again, if you want to beat those those top level players, remember like the painting analogy, you can't just use your primary paint set, you gotta use all your secondaries.